And I'm Russ McCaskey. We're glad you're here. A surprising pest shuts down Tulsa's busiest library. Bed bugs are to blame for the closure of the downtown branch, and it will stay closed until further notice. Two News reporter Liz Bryan is outside the Central Library with more. Russ, if you think they only show up in beds, that theory was proven wrong today. Now, every day, about a thousand people walk through these doors, and today, this is what they heard. Marvin Holloway just wants to surf the internet for a few hours until his wife gets off work. Is it election day or something? I mean, but Marvin's going to have to wait, and so will others. I wonder what the occasion is. Visitor. <laughs> Close. After visitor realize all inside activities oh, are canceled. I thought it might have been a holiday when I saw that it's closed. Exterminators are inside searching for any more bed bugs. You're kidding. This after a visitor was bitten by one at lunchtime while sitting on an upholstered chair and took it up to the counter to show staff. And it may be time to get rid of any overstuffed furniture, any um, upholstered furniture. Exterminators have to go through all the furniture in almost every inch of the 135,000 square foot building. Was it limited to that one chair? Is it spread at all? And it has spread. Exterminators found more in chairs that are a decade old. Library officials threw out all upholstered chairs on the second and third floors, replacing those with vinyl metal ones. Well, I won't sit down. For now, that pulling will continue. I, mean, I may wait a few days to make sure they get it good and clean before I come back. And exterminators do not believe fumigating the building is necessary. Tomorrow morning, they'll bring in a bed bug sniffing dog for an additional check at the earliest. If everything goes well, the library could open at noon tomorrow. Live in downtown Tulsa, Liz Bryant, 2 News, works for you.